Many market participants use SOFR futures contracts to hedge floating loan rates by using strips of SOFR futures. These strips are essentially a sequence of individual futures contracts spaced out at varying points along the yield curve. The problem with buying or selling a strip of contracts is that this process necessitates legging into each futures contract individually. This leaves traders open to price slippage or potentially unfilled orders. To make managing risk easier, CME Group offers SOFR packs and bundles. Packs and bundles simplify the way market participants buy or sell SOFR quarterly strips, which is especially useful for hedging longer-term floating rate loans. Think of a pack or bundle as the purchase or sale of a series of SOFR futures, representing a particular segment along the yield curve, to create or liquidate positions. Packs and bundles are offered at a single price or value and are transacted via a single order. This eliminates the need to enter multiple orders for each contract. It also eliminates the possibility that some orders may go unfilled or that prices move before the orders for all legs are executed. With most futures contracts, volume and open interest are concentrated in the nearby or front months. However, SOFR futures continue to experience growing volume and open interest in the deferred months, extending out almost 10 years along the yield curve. So, what are PACs? A SOFR pack is a simultaneous sale or purchase of a series of four consecutive SOFR futures contracts. Since SOFR futures have 39 quarterly expirations, four quarterlies every year for nearly 10 years, CME Group created color codes to avoid confusion. White represents the first year, red the second, all the way up to copper, which represents the quarterly expirations in the 10th year. For example, you could buy or sell a white pack, which is comprised of the first four quarterly SOFR futures contracts expirations. Alternatively, you could buy or sell a blue pack, which is comprised of the 13th through 16th quarterly expirations. While packs are limited to four consecutive quarterly contracts, covering one year of risk, bundles allow for multiple sets of four consecutive quarterly contracts to be traded in a single order. For example, a market participant may buy a two-year bundle which includes eight quarterly SOFR futures contracts, or they could sell a three-year bundle, which would include 12 quarterly expirations. Notice the BPV, or basis point value, continues to rise as you add more quarterly expirations in a bundle, whereas the BPV for a pack remains at $100, since packs only contain four SOFR contracts. The price of a pack or bundle is meant to represent the average price levels of the individual futures contracts, or legs, within the pack or bundle. They are quoted in increments of one quarter of one basis point, equivalent to $6.25. Once a pack or bundle is traded, it immediately decomposes into its constituent legs. Prices are then assigned for each of the legs, such that the average of these prices equals the traded price for the pack or bundle. Transactions involving both packs and bundles can be executed on the CME Globex electronic trading platform. For additional details about how SOFR packs and bundles work, a full white paper is available at cmegroup.com SOFR.